हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आई एम अरमोगान एंड यू आर वाचिंग निंजा इराकी दिनार यूट्यूब चैनल होप ओली यू ऑल डूइंग वेल गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस फॉर यू ऑल आई ट्राई माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू योर लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट इराकी दिनार सो गाइस लेट्स स्टार्ट टुडे द इंफॉर्मेशन they inform us that on july 18th iraq will officially join the wto though hints suggest we are already part of it A WTO representative mentioned this date is on their calendar and newscasts confirm that July 18th is when Iraq will be fully accepted without any restrictions or limitations on our currency. On the treasury side, there are many rumors circulating, ranging from claims that the change will happen tomorrow to assertions that it has been delayed by another month. These conflicting rumors, often coming from the same sources, indicate intentional misinformation. Despite the confusion, it is important to stay calm and focus on the fundamentals. Iraq is still in a strong position. The new ATMs are in place, discussions about deleting the zeros continue, and there are ongoing conversations about releasing lower denominations in July. Things still look very promising. An article by Professor Frank Gunter from Lehigh University, presented during a webinar organized by the Iraq Britain Business Council, explains why Iraq has two exchange rates. The primary reasons include excessive international demand for US dollars, internal demand for dollars, and the dollarization efforts by the New York Federal Reserve. The New York Fed has restricted dollar transfers to reduce dollar flows to Iran and Syria and has also excluded over 2 dozen Iraqi banks from transactions which has increased the complexity and demand for dollars in Iraq. In another development, Customs has completed the first phase of their automation project and revealed significant revenue gains within the first 5 months. Iraq has been kept in the dark ages for a long time with everything done by paper and pencil. and this was maintained deliberately however banking and other institutions are now experiencing significant changes with the introduction of new technology which is going to greatly excite them and make their work much more efficient the situation is only going to improve for iraq this technological advancement is one way they can generate revenue beyond oil which is exactly what they need to diversify their economy According to a quote, the revenue rate is expected to increase by 200% by the end of this year compared to 2022. This is a substantial increase signaling a booming future for Iraq. There are several developments out of Iraq today that should give us optimism. The president of Iraq has approved the 2024 budget schedules and Rashid has approved several laws including the 2024 budget tables. They informed us that the 2024 budget is based on an average oil price of $80 per barrel, which is progress. If the budget is published in the Gazette with the old rate, remember there are only two budgets left, one with the old rate and one with the new rate. If the budget appears with the old rate, don't worry, it will change very quickly. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more new videos.